Right then, so if I've done this right, this should be recording with the DJI Pocket 3 and with the microphone. I think I'm going to get into more confrontations than I normally would with one of these cameras, but because it's a bit more obvious, we'll soon find out. This dude here staring at me. Let's find out. So here we are. First trial. Good afternoon, morning, whatever it is. Right, let's see how we get on. I'm falling down straight away. So you should be able to hear my voice the whole time. Still eight quid. Oh, really? Bit of a guest t shirt. Weird fish hoodie. 15 each. I've got a zoom option. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Yeah, you're a bit less busy today or still manic? Man, so I miss a bit. Power game, new and sealed. That's now 7.50, I might have to get it for that. Let's have a look. S22B350H. So obviously it's a monitor, not a TV for a start. Because I'm an idiot. 49.99. Yeah, let's get it. Does it come with a power lead though? Oh, a smasher. How are you? What's been going? Oh, what's that? Do you mean to carry it for you anywhere? Tears of temper. Oh, there's a hair. No, you're alright. Do you know if this one comes with the lead? Do you know if this one comes no, with the lead? Didn't. That's why it's 15 then down to 7. Yeah, 50. the guy the guy said that you can get them off of eBay. Tinternet, yeah. Right. Yeah, sorry about that. That's alright, lovely, don't worry. Right, that'll do. Well, I'll catch you in a bit. See you later. Have a good day. Oh, sorry, my dear. Oh, yep. <laughs> well, nothing out of there, but it gave me a quick... Oh, I'm going to get one over. It gave me a quick little test run, didn't it, with the camera to see what it's like. I'm still going to put this out because I still want to be able to edit it down and see what's going on with it. Feels a bit weird holding it. Not too weird, but weird enough. And obviously there's going to be weird angles with the camera. There's a bit of f***ing hair. How long has that been on there for? We'll figure it out, won't we? You know what I mean? Right, let's go home. So nothing out of there, but I'm sure you can appreciate that. I'm still going to upload this because I need to see what it's like in all these different conditions. See the light in the garage now, the microphone need to see how long it lasts, what the sound sounds like. I've just got to test out all these different kinds of things, haven't I? I also want to test out if I can mount this. Yeah, I think I can. So this is basically like a test run video for me. I wanted to see it in action, really. So there's nothing really spectacular going on in this video, purely for my recording exporting, editing purposes only. Hope you enjoyed it. See you in a bit. <laughs> Actually, I lied. While I'm here, I might as well try and do some of the sales, aren't I, and see how that works out as well, right? My eyes might start changing position from up here to down here because you've got the camera up here and the monitor just down here, so it's a little bit confusing. Hello, kitty cat. So I've got a couple going out on Vinted that I thought I'd like to test out with the new camera. Another one for my own personal collection. Can you see the style that's going on? Right? With the jumper that makes me look old. £4.56 this sold for. It is a Boohoo Man, I believe. Yeah, Boohoo Man. Nice one. I paid about 18 quid for that from the website. Stop it, you little swine. Chlorine. Stop. Stop. doing that cat claw thing. So this sold to Christine. Thank you for accepting my offer, Ricky. Love watching you and your channel. You seem like such a genuine person. Your caring personality and kindness shines through. Thank you, Christine. No, Christine, thank you. This is on its way to you for four, five, six. Thank you so much, darling. And a lovely message as well. Thank you. Tomb of Doom sold immediately as soon as I listed it. I think I listed it for 12 pound, 12 pence, paid 3.50 for it yesterday. Sold on Vinted for £3.50 to Stefan. Stefan's made another purchase. Last time he picked something up from me, he was actually in Belgium. So he's not in Belgium today, but he still bought something. Doesn't matter where you are in the world, you can always pick something up. Remember to keep looking at the camera, Ricky. My God.
So Stefan, thank you, mate. I appreciate that. Picked up yesterday for £6.50. Sold them on Vinted quite quickly for £15.15. That's a nice little bit of tidy profit. I told you they'll sell fast if I list them cheap enough. I don't mind that. It gets it in, gets them out. So I picked up this yesterday plus Tomb of Doom. And what else did I buy? I can't remember, but I've sold both. I've sold two of the however many items I picked up. I can't actually remember. Nice little bargain, that is. Oh, somebody's picked up a bundle of three items there. I didn't even realise that. Let me go find them. Hold on. Where are they? Right, we've sold a bundle of three items now, and they have gone to Jordan. Jordan's picked this up. Hi, mate. Love the channel. Always makes for some good tea time viewing. You also inspired me to start reselling part-time, so big up, man, and keep smashing it. No, Jordan. You big up, and you keep smashing it. Stick to what you're doing. Stick to your guns. Get through the tough parts, and you'll soon ride it out, and you will be away. You'll be away. I'm not saying you're struggling now, but the beginning's always the hardest and the most exciting. So bear in mind that might wear out. For £12.34, he has picked up the Ralph Lauren Polo, the last one of these. Bargain prices, by the way, sent me quite under what it was. I think it was originally listed for like £18 something. He got it for £12 something. Plus the Tommy Hilfiger sparkly rhinestone cowboy jeans and the Assassin's Creed playthrough book. £12.34. Jordan, I appreciate you. That is going to be the end of the video. So I've managed to have a little look what it's like charity shopping. I've managed to give it a go filming the sales and then the rest of it will just be whatever after that. So I am going to try and use this as much as I can now. So bear in mind there's going to be some little hiccups and the quality might not be as good when it comes to editing or filming or camera angles. But that will only be a short period while I nail it. All right. Let's turn the mic on, shall we? Are we connected? Now we're connected. So I'm gonna need some feedback from you guys. I've just finished doing the video. We've been to the charity shop and stuff. And now what I want from you guys is to let me know about sound quality, vision quality, what you enjoyed about it, if you even noticed any difference at all. I'm still gonna be using the DJI action camera for the car boot sales and things like that. But I just feel like in the charity shops where I'm always recording with my phone anyway, I'm happy to only have one hand free that it's gonna be a lot nicer for me to go around and do the charity shops, which I'm gonna be doing a lot of during the winter months. Of course, that's our main sourcing slash content opportunities during the winter. So give me some feedback. Let me know what you thought of the video quality of the audio. And again, if you even notice a difference at all, I'd really appreciate it. I only watch them once when I'm editing then once when it's done. You guys watch them. It's for you guys. So let me know. I'm investing into the channel because I wanna invest into you. That's it, really, that's all I've got to say. Really appreciate you for watching. Thank you ever so much. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Love you all. Bye. I bet that sounds horrible.